What's happening, everyone? My name is Speed Streak. Welcome to Speed Streak Discussions, where we discuss topics relating to video games, movies, TV shows, comic books, or anything geek related. Now, continuing the the new tra new trailers and updates from Gamescom 2019, we'll be looking into a new update for the Sonic and Mario, um, well, the next Mario and Sonic Olympics game. Now, as you may have known, Sega and Nintendo have collaborated with each other ever since 2007 with their own. Mario and Sonic at the Olympics series, and Mario and Sonic have gone through plenty of Olympics, and they have fared pretty well. Now, for the last one, they may have added a couple additions here or there, but what are they? Well, it's time for us to look into the trailer and see what we can find out. Okay, then. Whoa, here we are. We're starting. Okay, so. Okay, so we've got boxing, horse racing, ooh, gymnastics, and swimming, javelin, of course, playable. Ooh, now this is cool. 2D versions? No way! 2D versions of the Olympics? And it, it has the similarities with... Wow! 10 out of 10! Wow, it's like... The mixture of uh, the 16-bit Sonic and the 8-bit Mario. This is amazing! Wrestling? Wow! <laughs> of course, Robotnik. Gymnastics! Oh, I... Come on, Sonic! Yes! Sonic is, of course, the fastest thing alive. And, and of course, according to K. Okay, KO, he beat Mario in the Olympics. Okay, I, this is awesome! This is a new update! This is pretty cool! Okay, I know this is a bit of a short trailer for Sonic and Mario, but still, even with this short trailer, there's so much to, so much in there! That is awesome! Hmm. Okay. As I stated before, even though it's there's only some, you know, this trailer is very short. It does show a lot of potential for Mario and Sonic Olympics, well, Tokyo. And I'm actually quite excited for this, even though I don't have a Nintendo Switch yet, but I might buy one soon. So without further ado, let's quickly break down to see what we can find out for the next Mario and Sonic Olympics game. So as the trailer starts, we see a couple of footage from the upcoming Sonic and Mario game with some of the Olympic games including boxing, I believe gymnastics dancing, swimming, and of course running. When suddenly everything changed when everyone turns from 3D to their old school classic 2D pixels. Suddenly, we now see our favorite video game characters now in their 2D classic forms do many other Olympic games including canoeing, diving, the longest jump, volleyball, interestingly enough, wrestling, as well as, well, running. I have to admit, when I first heard about this, it almost caught me off guard. This was actually the very first time that in a Sonic and Mario Olympics game that we could get to play our favorite Nintendo or Sega characters in their classic forms, which is actually very new and amazing for both Sonic and Mario fans. And to be honest, some of the Olympic games actually look very interesting in, in classic video game form. Well, it almost reminds me that it it almost looks as if that you can, you're playing a Sega or Genesis game or Nintendo game back either in the late 80s or 90s like this. What's interesting is that I read somewhere that this this Mario Olympics game will actually also have a story. It will feature time travel and as well as all the new characters including Eggman Nega. Overall, I can't wait to see what other surprises await in store for the Sonic and Mario Tokyo Olympic Games. So that was my reaction and thoughts for the Sonic and Mario Olympics Tokyo Gamescom trailer. I mean, 
What do you guys think? Are you excited for the 2D versions of Sonic and Mario and all their friends in the Olympics? What are your thoughts about it? And what do you think of the story mode? Do you think it will be really good? And I think I also read somewhere that the models themselves are, well, for Sonic Mario and their friends are really well done. And, I mean, what do you guys think? Well, let me know in the comment section down below. So that's all the time I have today for this video, but don't go anywhere, we still have plenty of news, topics, and updates to discuss soon. So stay tuned for more. So thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to super smash that like button. And leave a comment down below to see what you think about this video. And don't forget to share a friend if you want to. And be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get updated for the latest content. So once again, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. Speed Sweet.